Okay. Alright. I'm just making sure everything's good to go because OBS was acting a little funky. But it's- I think it's all good now. I think we're good. I think we're good. Good morning, everyone! Hi, Rywick. Hi, Wolf. Hi, Mishka. Welcome in. Good morning. I hope you're doing well, my friends. I, um... I, I had a bit of a sleepy start today. And, you know, I got ready. It was fine. I came over here to, like, get everything set up before I went and got coffee. OBS had, like, resized everything. So I'm like, oh, that's weird. But it's not a big deal. Like, I was able to move things where I needed to move them. Good morning, Pat. Welcome in. I was able to move things how I needed to move them. I resized everything. Good to go. And then I tested my, uh, I tested one of my alerts just to make sure the sound was feeding through for, um, for like follow alerts. And I was like, oh, that's weird. It's not feeding through. So I close it down. I reopen it. Now things are resized again. <laughs> I did this like four times because every time I thought I had it right, um, there'd be something I had to tweak or I'd like walk away to get coffee and I came back and it was freaking out. So I was like, well, that's weird, but it's fine. <laughs> like... <laughs> It's, it's fine. It's all good. So it, it seems to be working now. Um, but that is my, that is my excuse for being late to class. <laughs> good morning, Kanata. Hey, it's dawn of the third day. <laughs> yeah, actually it is. I should have used that as a, I should have used that. That would have been very clever. I did not. Maybe I will for the YouTube VOD. I'll pretend that I was clever all along. No one will know. <laughs> Good morning, Tex. How are you? I hope y'all are doing well. It is Friday. For anyone who is actually celebrating Friday, like you have tomorrow off, I, uh, I'm really happy for you. I hope everyone is doing well. Um, it's the third day of this game. The last time we played, we spent pretty much the entire stream... Hunting. Oh, shit. Wolf, I forgot my water bottle. You know why I forgot my water bottle? Because it's out in the car. Last night, I got home from work and I forgot to, I forgot to grab it. And as I was going to bed, I was like, oh, I should, I should get that. Ah, oh, it's fine. I'll get it in the morning. <laughs> um, I'm going to need that. Let me go get some water real quick. Um, it's not going to be in my in my official, like, creature of habit water bottle, but I will need some water. So give me just a sec, okay, guys? I can't believe I dropped the ball on that. It's been a long time since I've done that. I'll be back. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. Crisis averted. Wolf, I owe you two hydrates. Look, I brought it. I remembered all along. I never had to leave. Um, Wolf, thank you for reminding me. I appreciate it. What is this doing? I'm gonna, there we go. I appreciate it. I really do. <laughs> yeah, I know I left it in the car with a couple other things actually. And I was like, do I really need it? Not until tomorrow. Like, I'm fine. I don't need it. I don't need it. <laughs> So, um, thank you for the, thank you for the posture check, Rywick. So I was like, it's cool. It's fine. I'll remember. It's only 6 a.m. I certainly remember all the things at 6 a.m. So that happened. I don't need it. Aw, look, it's so cute. Wait, it's over, it's over here. Look, look, he's so cute. <laughs> in, you know, a suffery kind of way. I have today off and I'm off till Wednesday. I'm so happy. Oh, Tex, I'm happy for you. I'm also jealous and I, I wish I could be that happy. <laughs> I am, uh, I'm on, what is it? Is it, it's Thursday for me because uh, I work Saturdays. So today is Thursday for me, basically. Ah, uh, the forgot something in the car, but don't want to go get it conundrum. Yeah, exactly. I, cause like, I was in my PJs. I was ready for sleep. I was in my PJs in bed when I realized. And I was like, oh, I don't want to go back. It's cold and dark and I'm all cozy and warm. I don't want to go out there. So I didn't. And here we are. Here we are. That's easy for my wife. She makes me go get it. And then we find out she bought it and just misplaced. Oh, she brought it and just misplaced it. I see what you're saying. That sounds like me. I have walked through my home looking for my phone while <laughs> holding my phone. I've done that before. I'm like, dear God, where is it? I have to go. I'm late. And when I realize it's very humbling. <laughs> the ego is just fine after that moment. It's it's good. It builds character. Don't. <laughs> Anytime I forget something in the car, it's lost forever. Yeah, see, that's the thing. I'm gonna be there as soon as I have to go to work. So I was like, it. I should be fine. I just, yeah. I don't know. That happens to me with my keys and glasses. I've never done that with my glasses before because I am blind enough that if I don't have my glasses, I'm not getting out of bed. <laughs> Or like, I can get out of bed, but only to find my glasses. Like I am, I am really in need of them. So that's never been an issue for me. But uh, my keys, that's happened before several times. So I have a little like key hook that I put my keys on now because if I don't put them there, just everything stops. Like I, I'm a huge creature of habit. And if that habit is not continued the way it's supposed to be continued, everything derails until it gets back on track. I got to work with two different shoes on once. I don't think I've ever done that before. I have had a couple occasions where one of my coworkers has been like, oh, uh, can I say something? Like, can, can we talk? I'm like, sure, yeah. And they'll like pull me aside and be like, you know your shirt's inside out, right? I'm like, damn it. <laughs> I think I've done that two or three times and my coworker was really great about it. She was just like, you know this, right? I'm like, no, of course I don't know this. You think I realized it and left it this way? <laughs> no, I didn't realize. I didn't know. But uh, she was very kind to tell me because I'm sure half a dozen people saw it and just didn't say anything. I'm a firm believer if someone's walking by and it doesn't matter who it is, but if someone's walking by and they've got like toilet paper stuck to their shoe or something, you tell them. I'm a very firm believer. You like they deserve to be told unless you hate them, in which case that's different, but they deserve to be told. <laughs> and I've had that happen a few times at work where I have to pull aside a complete stranger and be like, look, I don't know how else to tell you this. <laughs> 
and they're always really appreciative, right? Like no one's ever like, how dare you? Everyone's always very happy that, that someone told them. So I think everyone should do a good deed. Point out that spinach in someone's teeth or something, you know. Um. <laughs> Wait. I found myself looking for my glasses when I'm friggin' wearing them. Exactly, my eyesight is so bad. How <laughs> can I not tell I'm not wearing them? I would, I, I can instantly tell if I'm not wearing my glasses. And, um, it's bad. I've, I've had uh, a couple times now where I'm like, I'm going to bed, I take them off, I put them on the table next to my bed, and then I sleep. During the night, I must like push them off the bed or something because I'll wake up in the morning and I can't find them. I mean, like seriously can't find them. I'm out of my bed on my hands and knees, like doing the whole Velma floor patty thing, looking for my glasses. <laughs> It, it gets to be that bad sometimes. Like, there has been only one occasion. There was one occasion when I could not find my glasses and I, I was going to be late. So I had to call my work and be like, I'm sorry, I can't find them. And until I find them, I can't drive. So, so I was late to work that day. It took me like 15, 20 minutes to find my glasses because like, they... They had fallen to the floor and then somehow got shoved under the bed and I was so blind that I couldn't see them, but I was like scared of stepping on them. It was a whole thing. Wait. Wait, what did someone at Ocean Shores do? What did I miss? Oh, I see. <laughs> it's called style. It's called style. I was hungover. In my defense, I was drinking. <laughs> If I lose my glasses, then I have to get my, ah, uh, uh-huh. I can only see six inches of, yeah, I've had to do that before. I've had to call on other people to help me. I'm like, please, please, dear God, help me find these. Cause I can't, I can't live like this. <laughs> and it like hurts my eyes if I don't have them for, for too long. Um, like sometimes I'll be having a lazy day in bed. Like I'll wake up on a weekend and I like grab my phone and I start scrolling on my phone just because it's a lazy day. I can stay in bed. And then I start getting this massive headache and I can't figure out why. And it's because I've been reading on my phone without my glasses for like half an hour or something. It's the worst. Miss Fortune, hello, good morning. How are you? I hope you're doing well. Have you seen the Comic-Con image where two people cosplaying as Velma and Psych- Ooh! Aww! Aww! <laughs> oh! No, I haven't, but I can- I can picture it! That's a good combo. Aww! It's not gonna end well. Mishka, you do not. You are a kind, kind soul. Vacation day! Oh, misfortune. I'm so happy for you and also very jealous. Bengali! Welcome in! I like your little... Okay, what is this dino actually doing? Is it just... Is it just doing, like, this? <laughs> it is! It is! I had to check because I was like, what's this little arms doing? Because they're very small until you, like, zoom in. It is! It's just doing a little dino dance. It's very cute. <laughs> Thank you for gracing us with the dino dance. That is that is lovely. And okay, and Miss Fortune's got one that's just what I I don't think I can open my my face holes that much. <laughs> it's just wah, 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 wah. <laughs> I'm really happy that we have Tingle with the confetti for this game. Like, that's perfect. I'm really happy that he was around for this game in particular. Oh, is that a raccoon? It is. Oh, that one's cute. That's a good one. Oh, this creator has some really good, some really good uh, emotes too. The OMG is really cute. Like the, the um, extreme zoom in is very cute. Oh, oh, there's a grub dance. Oh, the grub is adorable. Oh, I want a grub. Oh, 
it's so cute. Reminds me of the dance the monsters do in one of the Scooby-Doo intros. Yeah, oh yeah, it's very Scooby-Doo. Very, like, classic Scooby-Doo. Yo, what's up, Wander? Welcome in. Hello! Thank you for wandering by. How are you? Um, I got to dino dancing a little bit. I got distracted. I completed my nine-hour shift without food. Me angry. Oh, no. Yeah, go feed your face. Go feed your face with whatever it needs. Just listen to your body and give it whatever it wants. Because it's earned it. I, um... I forgot to eat breakfast yesterday or the day before. I'm usually bad at eating breakfast. And I was so cranky. It must have been... It must have been Wednesday. Because I, I forgot to eat breakfast in the morning when we were doing stream. I just forgot to eat. And... I, I finished up stream, I went to work, and then I had a story time, so I did story time. By the time I finished, it was lunchtime, and I was so hangry. Like, I was- I was trying not to, um, I was trying not to be hangry, but all of my coworkers were like, Hey, what do you think of this? Or, hey, what do you think of that? And I was like, what do I think? I think it's my lunch break. I'll tell you when I come back. And they were like, totally get it. Because we've all been there. We've all been there. Okay, chaotic. Hello. Good morning. What? Hang on. Let me just click on this really quick. Oh, okay. That's adorable too. That's a really cute emote. Oh, you guys have so many good ones. This is amazing. It needs dessert. Yeah, just pull a Lilo. Eat all the dessert. I never do breakfast. I, I don't most of the time. I did bring- I brought something to snack on today, actually. I, I brought something to munch on today because- because I should be doing breakfast. But the thing is, when I choose food to eat on stream, I go out of my way to make sure that they're, like, chewy, like this is just a, a fruit bar. I go out of my way to make sure they're chewy and not crunchy because you guys don't need to listen to me crunching away. It feels rude. My body just says, you've eaten too much cheese. Have a bit more cheese. <laughs> you've eaten too much cheese. You should maybe chase that down with some cheese to feel better. <laughs> you know, hair of the dog and all that. Here, eat a Snickers, because you're not you when you're hungry. Man, if someone saw me hangry and offered me a Snickers, I would be the happiest person in the world. Can I just say, like, it doesn't even matter really what they're offering as far as like junk food goes but if they see me hungry and they offer me chocolate that's it i'm their best friend now or they're my best friend like that's how it works it doesn't take much i'm a very simple person i wish people would offer me food more when i'm hangry <laughs> or taco bell if if i'm incredibly hangry and someone just shows up and they're like hey want some taco bell i'm like absolutely i want taco bell it's now gone from the worst day to the best day in 0.5 seconds. It's great. Gilbert has been extra fluffy since I took him to the vet to get- Aww, Gilbert! Gilbert is the cutest, and if Gilbert ever types in chat, I will- I will be so honored. <laughs> He's so cute! Well, you need a dancing quokas to start your day. Obviously! Everyone needs dancing quokas to start their day. Thank you. Thank you for blessing my day. But I don't miss out on free food from the office. I, yeah, my coworker brought in free food the other day. He was like, hey, there's donuts and snacks in the break room. And, and everyone else was like, bless you for being a good soul. And in my head, I was like, thanks. Donuts I can't eat. Thank you. <laughs> I was like, in my head, I was like, be nice. He was doing a nice thing for everyone else. It's not his fault that you're broken. <laughs> It was a very kind thought, uh, but I was really sad that I couldn't have any donuts. <laughs> it, it was really sweet of him for, you know, everyone else was very happy, but I was a little sad. <laughs> a little bit. These are down in the global emotes that Fickle should have. I didn't realize, so I knew the, um, I knew the dino dance was global, but I didn't realize the other one was global. I'll have to look into that. You're not you when you're hungry. Eat a snack. Yeah, exactly. Hi, Neat. Welcome in. 
Neat, I can't even tell you how excited I am for Sunday. I just want you to know. In my head, I've already dog-eared it. I'm like, Sunday, I'm gonna take off because it's my day off. And I'm gonna do stream things. And while I'm doing stream things, I'm gonna watch the Dragoon uh, playthrough. I'm very excited for it. I don't even know when it's gonna be, but I'm very pumped for it. You don't need to hear me chewing. It's rude. Take some of my chews. Yeah, but like seeing me chew and hearing me chew are two very different things. This this is not an ASMR stream. <laughs> that happens to me too. Oh, Bengali, I'm sorry. Is that because um, do you have like some food allergies or something? I can't recall if you've if you've told me before or not. I'm sorry, but yeah, I'm. There are some things that I just can't eat, and I'm sad. Because they're really good. I used to be able to eat them, which is why I know that they're good. But I can't now. I'd have eaten a donut and then gone home. Yeah, if I ate a donut, I would have had to go home. I would have been like, well, this has been fun. I know I've been here 20 minutes. Bye, guys. <laughs> there have been times where, like... I will eat a meal and then I'll look down like, you know, I, I got like a freezer meal or something for work. I'll eat it and then I'll look down at the packaging and go, oh, shit. Like, they, like I grabbed the wrong one or they changed some crucial ingredient. And I'm like, well, shit, I got to go home, guys. Like, it really is one of those things where um, I could be totally fine. I'll I'll eat something that I didn't know I couldn't eat. And then it's, I gotta go home because I'm gonna, I'm gonna feel terrible in about 20 minutes. Like, it's happened before. It's the worst. Mr. Bartleby, hello! How are you, my friend? I hope you're doing well. It's good to see you. I wish I could have eaten a donut. That would have been great. The opposite of a speedrun is the casual completionist, surely. Well, we're doing, um, we're doing the complete opposite of a speed run. So just a, a slow walk. We're doing a slow walk. <laughs> a casual meander through this game. We spent the whole last stream trying to find the stupid magic beans. And then once we, <laughs> we found a lot of people who wanted to sell the magic beans, but they refused to do so until I was taught how to use them. Because you need to use magic beans responsibly. So uh, now we know how to use them, and it's not that big a deal. Good morning. It will be any time between 1 p.m. and 4 p.m. This Majora's Mask Town music has me all nostalgic. I love it, but I know we can only listen to it so much on repeat, so uh, I will jump in in just a minute. I promise. Um, no, if I don't have any allergies, but sometimes it's the person I ate who offers the best food. Oh... <laughs> So, Bengali, I love food. Everyone knows that I love food. Like, this is not a secret. I love food. I'm a huge foodie. That being said, <clears throat> I'm also pretty decent at holding a grudge. <laughs> I know this about myself. It's something that we should all recognize if we are uh, one of those people. We should recognize it and, and observe it. And I'm pretty decent at holding a grudge when I want to be. And so if someone I hate brings in amazing food, I won't touch it. Even though it's my favorite food and I want it, I won't touch it. In my head, I'll be like, you traitor. If you touch that food, you can't hate them anymore. And I, I need to hold on to that. So, so I'll walk away from good food for that. Which is not a good sign. <laughs> if I were dying... If I were dying of hunger, then I would eat the food and bury the hatchet. But, uh, I'm not there yet. <laughs> That's terrible. I'm a terrible human being. I, like, have you guys ever disliked someone so much that you're like, I don't want anything to do with them, including anything nice they ever do for me? <laughs> it's basically shooting myself in the foot. I know this, but I'm still gonna do it. <clears throat> Um, did you eventually, oh, oh, find out where to get them. Uh, yes, yeah, I found out where to get them. It took a little bit, but we got there. Um, if I'm lucky, I'm launching my new app. Ooh, you have an app 
Kanata? That's so cool! That's so exciting! What kind? What does it do? I mean, if that's if that's okay to ask. If it's not, if it's gonna be like doxy or anything, don't worry about it. I never asked. You can lie to me. I don't know much about apps. You can just, <laughs> you can make something up and I'll be on board with it. Oh, I didn't know you were an app developer. Oh, that's so cool though. That's so cool. Note to self, don't tip off the goal. I mean, it's gotta be, that's the thing. It's gotta be pretty bad for me to get like to that point. It's gotta be really bad. And, and it very rarely happens because if I'm irritated with someone, I just leave. Like, I'm like, I don't need to be here around you. I'm just gonna go because I don't want to be around the, that kind of person. So it's really just, um, it's, it's really just like very special circumstances. It, it very rarely continues, like, long enough for it to get to that point. It's usually, it's probably usually a work thing because I have to be around that person, even though I don't want to be. I kind of have to be. So it's probably more of a work thing than anything else. Uh, there, there was once one or two family members that was like that, but uh, you don't have to be around your family. <laughs> Just because their family does not give them a free pass to treat you like shit. You can walk from those people, and let me just tell you, I've done it and it's great. Yes, my ex. Oh yeah, yeah, exes are the same. Exes are fantastically skilled at getting under your skin. <laughs> They're so good at it, because I've had a lot of time to perfect it. I feel that way about everyone all the time. <laughs> I'm so happy. Um, I, I feel seen. I feel heard. Thank you, guys. This this feels better. They try to be nice to me. It confuses me. Oh, my God. We have... So, we had a patron that I worked with at my previous library who uh, was such a witch, for lack of a better word. She was... God, she was... There were a lot of things going on, but she was so mean all the time. Like, just... All the time. You pick up the phone, she's already yelling. I had to hang up on her before because I was like, I don't get paid to take this abuse. You can ask me with your adult words or call back another day. And she started screaming at me and I hung up on her. Like, it's happened before. I'm like, you can use your grown-up voice or we can start screaming and I'm going to hang up. Um, but she came in one day super happy and it was the weirdest creepiest shit ever like she was smiling from ear to ear she used all her manners she was very polite and when she left like that concerned me more than when she was angry <laughs> i was like is she okay is someone dying like there's no reason for her to be this happy otherwise and i'm not comfortable with this okay i think it's time i think it's time to get into it I, um, I did, I did go back. I traveled back in time because I wanted to restart the clock and then I lost track of time. I forgot, I forgot how quickly time moves when you don't slow it down. So I've been like thinking this through. I need to, um, I need to go back to the first, like dawn of the first day. And then as soon as I do that, I need to use the song to slow it down and then we can move on. Um, you have 12 apps, Kanana? That is so cool. It's a corporate app that gets mobile billing data and generate. Oh, I imagine that's very important for a lot of people. It's not something I will ever use, but I imagine that's one of those things that is very helpful for people in the field. Hi, Magnus. Hello, Pickle. I hope you're having a great morning. In which part of the swamp are you at the moment? Well, at the moment, I'm in town. So let's just, uh, let's just jump over here. Guys, this game, I love it. Okay, um, I made two save files. Uh, shit. It wasn't this one. No. Was it this one? I guess I'll find out. And if I need to reset it, I can. Hang on. This one has three. This one also, yeah. Okay. 
pretty sure it was this one. Pretty sure. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. It's the one with the magic beans. So let's just, yeah, okay. We're on, we're on file one. If I ever forget in the future, file one is the one for me. I made a backup just in case because it was acting a little finicky the first day we played. Thank you, Bengali. I appreciate it. Look, I have water. Someone reminded me because I forgot my water bottle and it's out in the car and I didn't want to go get it. Okay. But she didn't do weird stuff with the computers, right? No. No, she, she was computer illiterate and she made sure everyone knew. No, but there's been a development with that. There's been a development. Um, <clears throat> but it's kind of one of those things I'm not sure... I'm not sure if I'll get in trouble if I talk about it on Twitch. So I'm kind of like, I'm, I'm, I want to talk about it, but I don't know if I'm going to get in trouble because it involves a minor and some sketchy stuff. And like, while it's a true story of something that occurred, Twitch is touchy about that stuff. So I, I'm not going to talk about it, but there have been developments that um, are, are interesting and I, I can't wait to see what happens. Pokesmot, good morning. I see you started playing the most stressful game ever. Is this game the most stressful game ever for you? Yeah, back to the clock. <laughs> okay, um, really quickly before I forget, we're at dawn of the first day, so I need to slow things down a little bit. Um, down a right, okay. Okay. Down a right, down a right. Okay, I forgot to do this last time. We also use an app for making bills and estimating time for some- Okay. Yeah, I think it's going to be very helpful for people in the corporate world, for sure. Uh, that being said, I know nothing about the corporate world. This game, I love it. Fickle before she learns to hate this game. Well, so far, I'm having a lot of fun with this one. Okay, so, um, I know how to use the beans. So I need to go- Well, I mean, I guess I need to go back and get beans, but I kind of don't at the same time. Um, what I need to do here, I need to do the fast travel real quick to get me back to where, where I need to be. So that's going to be this one down left up. Okay. Okay. The one with the magic beans. I don't remember that friends episode. Uh, it's coming. Just, you know, give it some time. You never know. Okay, Southern Swamp. That's what we want. The fast travel makes me feel so much better about the whole time element. It was stressing me out so much, but it makes me feel much better about the whole thing. Except I do have to be cautious to, like, pause it when I'm reading through what you guys are saying. So, bear with me here. I think this game was the catalyst for my anxiety. Neat, have you played this game? Like, have you finished this game? I assume you played it, but have you finished it? Did you get through it? We got a letter from people in my building that the old people in the building are offended that messages come via email because they refuse to learn how to use technology. <laughs> and I want to slap them. I hate when people come in and they tell me I'm, technolo or, I'm technology illiterate or I'm computer illiterate. Can you do this for me? I was like... I can get you set up on a computer. I can show you how to sign in with your library card. But once I get you set up, you got to learn. And they're like, but I don't know how. I'm like, well, I can show you how. I'll teach you how to fish, but I ain't fishing for you. And, uh, you know, they figure it out. They figure it out or they come back with, like, their grandson. Or their son. Or, or like, a parent. I've seen people my age come in and be like, what's a mouse? I'm like, what is wrong with you? Where have you been? <laughs> Even I'm like, where have you been? Because, <laughs> like, I, I wouldn't consider myself extremely tech savvy. But I've got enough know-how to figure this out. Like, it took a while, but there's a huge, massive learning curve. But we're here. It's stressful for a lot of people. You are literally chased by the clock the entire time. But it's not so bad. You buy yourself a lot of time with the with the different slowdowns and jumps and all sorts of stuff like that. Email is not new technology. And if you can't use it, it's a... Yeah, that sounds like a you problem to me. 
I played this game a lot, even used a guide to get all the maps in a single playthrough. I'm, I'm not using any guides, but I might also not get all the masks. So let's just be clear about that. <laughs> that might not happen. Um, but we'll see. We'll see how far I get and how much I love this game. Because if I like really, really love it and I'm determined, I might get all of them. Who knows? Played? Yes. Finished? I think so. Completed? No. Well, I mean, f for me, finishing it is completing it. I know that sounds... I know that sounds not accurate at all, but I'm not a completionist. For me, finishing it is the main goal. Okay. So. I can buy magic beans from this guy now. Oh, shit, I didn't grab money! Okay, he wants to move, but I don't need him to move, and I don't want him to move because I'm gonna need beans from him. So, I'm gonna need some money. I forgot. I forgot to grab that. Because I, I put all my money in the bank before we time jumped. I need, like, what? Oh, I'm gonna need, like, 15 for the, um... Did I keep the pictograph? Yeah, I did, but I don't have a picture. Okay. I need, like, 15 for the boat ride. Let's just do that, because I don't think the magic beans are going to be entirely necessary. Do I need the magic beans? Shit, I should have grabbed some money. I forgot. Oh, oh, oh. oh okay. barrier these people have is sending an email. Yeah, I know. Which is kind of sad. I've heard old people serious, seriously complain about typing on a computer and say typewriters are better. It, it is the same thing. I have a typewriter and I love it dearly, but it is the same thing. You don't really need the guide to beat it, but if you collect all the masks, you can trade them. Okay, don't tell me too much, Pokespot. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Okay, uh... Let's do... Let's just do anything else, because I don't want to... Okay. God, I forgot I was gonna... I forgot I was gonna need money. Should I jump back? Is it worth it? Probably. Alright, fine. Fine. Don't really... Yeah, okay. I've read that one. My mom uses a USB flash drive every day for work. She's too scared to figure out how to use an external hard... I mean, a flash drive is fine. Like, as long as it gets the job done, right? I I usually have to explain to people what a mouse is and how to click it. Like, that's the level we're at. It's a really cool bonus at the end if you get all the masks. I won't spoil it, but it's really good. Oh, okay. I'm intrigued. I, I want the bonus. I want the bonus now. Oh shit, where's the, um, where's the bank? Thank god I have a map, but I don't know, <laughs> I don't know where the things are on the map. Okay. Money? Yeah! Money! Okay, we're getting there, guys. We're figuring it out. I did stick some money in the bank. I've only completed this game once and I used a guide. It's one of the few games I recommend using a guide to 100%. I don't want to use a guide though. I want to figure it out. Endowed Era Opulence. That is a name. Welcome in. Okay, uh, we need some money for this. Ah, yes. I remember you. Even though no one else does, I remember you. Um, let's do like... Maybe 50? Maybe 50? Just just to make sure we get through whatever it is we need to get through. Because we'll get more on the way. Broke lady. Yeah, he's a little broke. But it's fine. Hero of time. He's fine. <laughs> he's fine. Try to be a little more careful as a group of not spoiling too much. Yeah, I know it's hard. It's really hard to keep things in. <laughs> it's hard. 
Okay. Uh, now we can fly back. Now I got money. That was worth it. It probably saved us some time just using the speed travel instead of... Um, instead of going around cutting grass everywhere. The fast travel is so nice. It makes me feel so much better. I thought I was gonna have to walk on foot every time I went back in time. <laughs> Look at him cheering for me! Okay, that was adorable. That was adorable. Someone's playing Zelda and I can't backseat! Yeah, I know, it's gonna be hard. Just keep, just keep all those comments in, just shove them down deep where no one can find them. And it'll just, you know, <laughs> torture you. Okay. Um, get some quick magic beans. He does not need the deed this time around because I got the heart piece. We're good. Um, I know we want to help, but we have to respect streamer's wishes. Yeah, this this streamer's wishes, they're, they're difficult. <laughs> they are. Because I don't do backseating. I don't do uh, spoilers. I'm pretty much like, let me fly. Okay. All right. Um, sell me magic beans. Yeah, I think we're going to need some of those. Not a ton, but maybe like three. You'll be in this town a lot. You eventually have a burn into your memory. I probably will. The problem is I get so lost. So it's it's good that we're playing this game regularly. Because I play it three times a week. If I didn't, if I played it like once a week, I'd be so screwed. Because I'd never remember. Some... <laughs> yeah, no, ba no backseat. I know it's hard. It's so hard. I know it is. I feel for you guys. I know why, or I know how it's hard, because, uh, I just finished Legend of Dragoon, and I know some of the things about it now, like the storyline, and I'm watching Neat play through Dragoon right now, and just keeping all of that in my mouth, and not, not letting it out through my fingers, it's very difficult. Okay. Um, so now we need to go back to human. We need to be in here to pay our way onto the boat ride. Okay. <gasps> oh, shit! We have to do this again? Is there a way around this? Can I just, um... Interesting. I forgot about that. <sighs> and there's no way I can go around... No, I think there is. Let's, uh, let's try it. I love that you can spin into it. It makes you faster. That is a really handy tip. Okay. So, where is... That way? Okay. I think there was a way to get through there as a Deku without having to, uh, without having to take the boat. I think. Oh, but I think that was still probably after we got rid of the octopus. Well, shit. Yeah, because there's another guy over there. Ugh. I have to do that again? Alright. I learned my lesson. Don't... Don't backtrack if you don't have to. Alright. Fine. Where's this hag? Forgot where she is. At least it's fast. I'm gonna need to, uh... Oh! No! Uh, uh, I'm gonna need to fill the bottle with the health potion. I'm gonna need to do that. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. Sorry, guys. I'm just catching up. Uh, kids, kids in backseat may cause accident. Accident in backseat may cause kids. No backseat, no accident. Single cab. <laughs> Played this game like 20 times. That'll impress the streamer. It does impress me. It does, Miss Fortune. I am adequately impressed. Uh, okay. So I need to go up here. I've already done this bit, but we gotta go back and do it again because I forgot. Wait, 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 wait. There's a ladder around this side? Hold up. What is... Oh, I don't like that. But what's... Hmm. I'm like leaning this way to see if I, I can see around these shitty cameras. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know people love this game, but... Oh, there we go. I can do that. But I hate some of the camera angles on these N64 games. I love N64. I love Nintendo. But the camera angles are the worst. It was that was my biggest complaint about um Banjo or Banjo Kazooie, not Banjo Tooie. I got a single cab and I have two children. Okay, Pokemon, there's no helping you. So we're gonna need this. We're gonna need this bottle. Oh man, letting a fairy go just hurts me so much. Just hurts. I got. I gotta go to work. I don't wanna. Oh, Pokesmot, I feel for you, man. I do. Wake up. Okay, I need. I should have grabbed more money. Oh, oh, oh! Nope, nope. I need. Um, and she wants mushrooms. Interesting. Why do you want mushrooms? Your sister is missing and all you care about are mushrooms. 20. Okay. All right. Let's uh let's go get your sister. Speaking of Zelda, yesterday one of the streamers I watched completed a game. Oh. Trasia, is that how you pronounce that? I don't even know what that is. Afterwards, she remarked, well, we finished a game that's named after a princess we barely see. Someone in chat was like, that's literally every... It's true. It's every Zelda game. Okay. Uh... Huh. We need to go this way. Alright. Let's do this again. Trixie monkey. Affleck. <laughs> no! Ferocious turtles! Okay. Camera is the main reason I've not played any N64 Zelda game for more than 10. Really? Tex, you've never you've not played any of them for more than 10 minutes? Wow. Interesting. How have you How have you managed that? <laughs> the cameras are annoying though. Rocket! Thank you for the gifted sub. That's so sweet of you. And welcome back. Thank you for the gifted sub. That is so so sweet of you. All right, let's uh, do that. Perfect. Dinkle, welcome in. I didn't die this time. Hey, that's that's what we want. That's what we want to hear. Okay. You got hit from behind by the school kid. Um. This. Take it. Look at all those navies and towels. Yeah, I mean, they're there all the time, but today is a particularly good day to have it, right, with this game? Well, I'm off the bus, waits for no one, have a good stream. Bye, Wolf! Wolf's probably already gone. Bye, anyway! 
what I do. Oh, you know what you did. Just just a little something, but you did it. And it's all you. <laughs> Welcome in, Rocket. All right, Kume's revived. Now we can do what we gotta do. I, f I totally forgot I was gonna have to go back. All right, good, we need some money. Oh wait, no, we don't, because she's gonna offer us a free um, a free tour for this, so that's perfect. We just need to go through any of these to get us back. Although I did see I did see some uh, oh oh monkeys converging. Okay. Now we need to go back this way. Just follow the monkeys. We need to get back on the boat ride. Okay. Um, boat ride is that way, I believe. Okay. Huh. Huh. Yeah, the spinny, the spinny jump moving into, or the, the spinny spin moving into the uh, lily pads is very, very helpful. Gives you that speed boost I didn't know I could get. Someone mentioned it last time and I was like, oh, son of a bitch. That actually works pretty well. Okay. All right, boat's leaving. This this boat cruise is really cute, though. It really is. Games that control the camera for me. Nope, you can have them all pass. Tex, I totally get it. I to it, it frustrates the hell out of me sometimes. <laughs> Completely understand. Look at how scenic this is. It's lovely. Am I supposed to be shooting that? That looks like something I should shoot. And there's, um, there's money all over the place. And there's this dude who's about to die tragically. Aw, oh, rest in peace. And we're in. <laughs> Miss Fortune, you got first. <laughs> Good job. You were here all along. I knew you were. All right. Yep, we're disembarking. Let's let's do this. Yeah, you were just biding your time. You knew. I believe in you. If the monkeys go over a cliff, do not follow them. You don't you don't follow death-defying monkeys. That just seems unwise. Okay. So, this was where we left off last time. I know. Uh, we left off last time. This was the way we needed to go. Uh, getting through here was interesting. But I need to get all the way through so that I can get up, so that I can go on the platforms. It's a whole thing. Disneyland's Jungle Cruise Link Edition. <laughs> All right, uh, we're just gonna scoot around this dude. I have to say, these Deku scrubs are much, oh shit. They're much more attentive than, uh, than Zelda's castle guards. Her castle guards are not as attentive. All right, yeah, I'm sorry, I broke the rules. I know, I know. It's actually easier to avoid these guys during the night because it shows how far ahead of themselves that they can see. It's much easier to avoid them in the evening. All right. I'm not here. You don't see me. You don't see me. Shit. 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 
No, you don't see me. I'm not here. I am not here. Oh, I hope there's not one over here. Money! Okay, where is he? Okay, we're good. We're good. We break for it! Okay. Where are they? There he is. Okay. I'm just gonna stay out of his line of vision. Yep, this is good. These guys are much more attentive than Zelda's guards. She should be hiring them. I need to go in here? I can't remember where I had to go last time. Oh wait, this is for the beans. No, but there's something else I need to do. Okay, let's um let's get we'll get spring water from here. Cuz we need that for the beans. I'm going to need more bottles in this game. But I don't think I remember planting the uh planting the bean, but I don't remember if it got me I can't remember if it got me up where I need to go or if it was just like a bonus thing that I grabbed because I know there was there was a path around the back where I had to plant a bean I can't remember okay I just can't remember. I might have to do it just to be safe. Let's, uh, let's plant one of these guys. It's been a little bit. Wait, what do you mean it doesn't work here? There we go. I love that you can speed up the, <laughs> you can speed up the growth of the magic beans. We don't have to wait seven years like in the last game. There we go. Okay. So we need to um, refill on the spring water because we're going to need more of that. All right. Let's just see. I don't think it was... I don't remember where it took me. Oh, was it just rupees? Was it just rupees? Oh, well. Rupees are good. We need them. We actually need them for the game. I mean, you could wait seven years for the place to be obliterated. That's true. I could. I could. Power's in my hands. Their fate is in my hands. So, in that case, and this guy is going to sell me more beans, but I've got, uh, maybe I should get a couple more. I don't know how many I'm going to need. So far, I haven't noticed any indicator of inflation. So far. Like, he just keeps charging 10 rupees, which is good. Because I remember in the last game, he would increase his prices the more you bought. Alright. Um... I thought the answer was in here somewhere, so I'm going to keep looking. I have a recollection, because I need to get up on one of those jump pads. Oh, you know what? It probably was on the outside. Let's get caught real quick. I think it was on the outside. I think this is my favorite song in the game. This one's, this one's groovy. I like it. It's hopping. So I think it was over this way. Yeah, I think it was this way. 
where we had to plant the bean. Okay. So. Link needs to plant a bean here. And we'll water it. I really want to get through this temple today. That's kind of my goal for the day. Alright. Yeah! This is what I need. This is what I need. Okay. It helps once you know where you're going. Can't see. There we go. There we go. That is what I needed. Hey! Josh! Thank you. I, I appreciate it. Oh, beans! Who's beans? Oh, I hope beans enjoys it. Alright. I hope beans gets a lot of love out of these emotes. <laughs> I need to grab that platform. You keep finding the funniest names. I love it. This is a really fun game so far. I'm enjoying myself. Okay, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, oh. Coordination. Ah, oh, wrong button. Shit. I forgot they're shooting at me. That is unnecessary and uncalled for. We're just gonna go over here. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, grab it. Okay. Okay. Nobody panic. Go, 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 go. All right. I can't see. I need that one. Okay, we're gonna wait for a sec. Welcome in, Northwind. Okay, I need that one. Go. Oh, please get it. Please get it. Oh, no. Oh, it's gonna be close. <laughs> yeah. Damn straight. Uh, okay. <sighs> Nobody panic. <laughs> Northwind, thank you for the follow. Yet again, my follow alerts are acting funky today, but thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. I hope you have fun here. Okay. Um, I need to grab that platform. But this one's really weird. Go. This is the one I didn't get last time. Come on, come on, come on. Yes. Okay, where are we? Where are we going? Where are we going? Oh, shit. Is it gonna go up higher? Yeah, that's what I need. Hello. Hello, beautiful. Okay. Nobody panic! <laughs> Nobody panic! Alright, let me catch up. Is Beans cool? Absolutely, their name is Beans. My coffee maker included- thank you for reminding me, Dingle. My coffee maker included two little cups and there's literally no way you can hold one without <laughs> burning your hand. I'm drinking out of a giant mug of, um, I don't give a shit for the day. Like, this is just, this is my day right here. I recommend one of these. I recommend one of these. Okay, I made my joke of the day. Is that your joke of the day, Beans? Good joke. Good joke. How's your morning? It's not going too bad. Um, I forgot that when I, uh when I went back in time, back to day one, cause I had to save after the last stream before I had to go to work. So I went back in time to day one. I forgot that he, it erased some of the things like saving the witchy witch. So I had to go back and, you know, save her sister all over again so I could get on the boat so I could get here. But you know, we're getting there. They're shooting at me. <laughs> this is unnecessary and uncalled for. Well, it is. How dare they? Does I don't give a shit taste pretty good? <laughs> I mean, I'm enjoying it. <laughs> I'm enjoying the uh, the general apathy cup. 
This is, this is a cup of apathy and I'm enjoying it quite a bit. Kyle, good morning. Happy Friday, my friend. Good joke, good joke. Is that like good soup? All right, um, uh, monkey, monkey. Hi, monkey. Oh, oh, you are, um, right. That's right, you're tied up. Did I just mess something up by jumping down here? Hi, monkey. Uh, talk to me. All right, yeah, I know that. I'm really excited to meet this Deku princess. Cause that sounds magical. Fine, I get it. Then I shall say nothing more to you. Punish me or do whatever else you might. But why? Why would I do that? Can I can I shoot him down? Am I just gonna kill this monkey prisoner if I try shooting him down? Is that what's gonna happen here? All right. Uh. Oh. Oh. I um. I spit slime. Look, guys, it's like green goop. I didn't realize. So these are snot bubbles. That's what this is. Classy. Okay. What happens if I change back here? Are they gonna have a conniption? What do I do? Hmm. What if I talk to you in... Oh, okay, there we go. <laughs> what if I talk to you in human form? They see you, they'll capture you. Well, I know that. My brothers asked for your help. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> Try to cut my rope, we'll talk after- How the hell am I supposed to- Okay. You're tied up a little high, dude. If you hadn't noticed, I am a short king. Oh, shit. Wrong way. Okay. Uh. You don't have happen to have something that can make a lot of noise, like a loud instrument, but it's a sound that carries a long way. I do, actually. If you have one, show it to me. This monkey's weird. You wouldn't happen to have a loud instrument on you by chance. <laughs> what? <laughs> this monkey's so weird. Ever seen Groundhog Day? That's a good model for this game. Yeah, it does It does have those vibes, doesn't it? Yeah, time resets are fun. It really messed with my head when I played what state this is. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I think that's what's confusing me. The fact that not everything goes back, but most of it does. So I'm like, well, what about this? Am I going to keep this? What about this? I mean, I'm keeping knowledge, which is good because I can remember things. So like my knowledge of the magic beans stays when you go back in time. But my actual magic beans in my pocket go away. So like, it works. Um, wait, hello? Look. No. Hi. If you have instrument that can blare out a lot of sound, it will carry a long way. Okay, so I'm guessing I need to now be in Deku form because it's louder or more. <sighs> okay. That guy, where did he go? <laughs> there. Oh, you have them, you do, just like the princess. Deku pipes! They're so cute. The, the Deku pipes are really cute. By the way, who are you? <laughs> well, that's not important now, just listen to me. Oh, am I gonna get a song? I was trying to find out about the poison in the swamp, so I went to Woodfall Temple above the waterfall. Oh, so th this isn't even it yet. Like, I need to get to the temple. I'm not there yet. Got it. Okay, uh, what do you mean? Everybody has loud instruments in their pockets. Oh yeah, all the time. Pork, thank you for the lurk. Ion, welcome in. Duh, pipes. <laughs> welcome in. Um, I need to get me a cup of apathy. I highly recommend. Highly recommend. It wouldn't be a game from Japan if it didn't have snot bubbles. Do they frequently have snot bubbles? I guess thinking back, a lot of a lot of the um, N64 games that I played do in some weird ways. Like there's there's some guards in Paper Mario that blow snot bubbles when they're asleep. Um, pretty sure in Banjo Kazooie it was there too when they were sleeping. So I guess that makes sense. Everyone keeps a set of 
massive pipes in their pocket. Everyone. But the temple had become a monster's lair, and the princess was captured by the monster. Since the Deku king thinks I kidnapped the princess, he won't listen to a word I say. Now the princess is in trouble, so I must somehow hurry to the temple and save her. Do you understand? I mean, kind of? So then, that means... You will go in my place and save the princess. That's not what I said. I said I understand what you're saying. No, 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 no nodding of the head. <laughs> okay, now I'll teach you the melody that opens. Oh, perfect. Princess taught it to me. We can't let them hear us, so I'll sing it softly. Oh. Oh. It's kind of cute. Okay. Sonata of Awakening. Look at my stylish pipes! As they're all staring at me. Look at how cute I am! <laughs> I'm so cute! Okay. Kia, welcome in. Can I call you that? Is that okay? Hey, and yes, this game is one very big link going with the flow. I mean, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty much... Sounds about right. That was pretty much Ocarina of Time, too. This melody awakens those who've fallen into a deep... S oh, okay. That's handy. Everyone, did you hear that? This melody, which only the Deku royal family knows... It proves the foolish monkey deceived the princess so he could enter the temple. <laughs> the monkey just signed his own fate. Everyone, let the monkey's punishment commence. Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Are they going to kill the monkey? Better take the shortcut the Deku people use to the... Okay. You must hurry. If you don't, I'll be punished by the Deku king. I mean, he's really taking his sweet time, isn't he? Oh, thrown out again. Okay. Shad, good morning. Okay, sorry guys, let me catch up. I just have to pause every now and then to catch up on chat so that I don't run out the time, because that will be me. Okay. I could make a dirty joke so easily with that pipes comment, but I'll refrain. I know, I know, Josh. As soon as I said it, I was like, man, that's one of those things that maybe shouldn't have been said on stream. On a stream that's being recorded. Like, maybe I shouldn't have, but it was too late. I couldn't take it back. I won't. I won't take it back. I'm not sorry. He understands nothing will get done if he doesn't do it himself, right? If you want the job done right, just go do it yourself. Fuck the side quest. We're on a mission. <laughs> <clears throat> All right. Um, secret Deku path. So that way got us in. I think this way is supposed to be... I think this is supposed to be to the, uh, temple. No, Deku shrine. <sighs> There's also another entrance over there to something. I think that was... Um, let's follow this one for now and see what we get. I love the little speed boost. This is good. Keeps me from drowning. Okay, so that one's blocked off. Let's go the other way then, because that's the only way. Do not like that moon hanging over me right now. It's really creepy. So, if we go this way... Oh, don't drown. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. So, we went this way once before. Is this the right way? Here we go. Woodfall shortcut, that's what I need. 
Shag, congrats on your big win last night with uh, Jackbox. I had to buy myself some time because I was like, don't say congrats on your big win with Emily because that will sound bad. So I had to come up with more, <laughs> more words that were more descriptive and offered more context. <laughs> okay. Howdy, are we suffering? Uh, we're doing all right so far. It's still the first day. Um, we've still got some things we gotta do. Okay, so there's another dude down there that's blocking things. And I remember in this, what is this, a pineapple? It looks like a pineapple. Um, this structure over here has a bunch of spiders. I remember that. There's dragonflies that want to kill us and also they have electricity. So there's that. Um, things are going all right so far. We, we got through to the monkey. What are these things? I don't recall seeing them in other Zelda games. Are these in other Zelda games? Oh, come on. Die. There we go. Are they just in this game? Because I don't recall seeing them in other Zelda games before. You know, there's a lot of, there's a lot of creatures and uh, enemies that come back, but I don't recall seeing that one. Astro! Welcome in. Congratulations on liking boys. Welcome, welcome. We're, we're not suffering too bad. I think we'll suffer later when we get closer to, uh, when we get closer to the moon crushing us and killing us. But right now I feel, I feel okay. I'm kind of in a comfy place. Okay. I don't know which way I'm supposed to be going here. I'm guessing it's that way. Huh. What? Where am I going? Is it that way? Oh! Oh, I see where we are now. But that's... So that's the entrance. Uh... This one. Got it. I was like, where the hell am I supposed to be going? Alright. So, this, notes are carved in the stone. Okay, so is this where I need to play? Can't remember the tune. We're making progress, guys. Cat, welcome in. Triforce, welcome in. Fickle, you amazing human being. Triforce, thank you. That's so sweet. I'll be the coolest streamer on Twitch. Okay, that's that's a bold faced lie. But thank you for saying so. <laughs> I have never been considered the coolest at anything. <gasps> did you see the direct yesterday? I did. I did. I I happened to wake up and um and when I woke up I I checked Twitch and there were a couple people I knew that were streaming the direct, so I just watched it with them. Um, it was interesting because I, like, I watched the direct with one person, the direct ended, and then I jumped over to another person because I knew they were talking about the same thing because I wanted to hear what both takes were. And they had very different opinions on it. So I'm kind of intrigued to see how this plays out. Um, and, and the takes were both about Thousand Year Door. <laughs> so, you know, I'm kind of intrigued. Oh, this is where I... Is that what the notes were? Okay. So I need to continue on this way.
Maybe. Okay. Um. I do remember that. Oh, oh, okay. I remember coming in here. We got in here and I was like, the fuck, why does this just end? Oh, okay. Because I was supposed to uh, play the song on that final platform, but I didn't have the song yet. So I was like, what the hell? Why is this just ending here? Ah! Oh, shoot it! Okay. Yeah, I remember this place. We got all the way to the end and I was like, why are we just stopping? I want to blow a snot bubble at you. Hold still. Okay. That went all right. That went all right. Ah! No! No, no! Oh! That worked. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how that worked. Um, now I remember this guy hurting me before, so let's see if we can, like, get a little creative with how we do this. Ah! There- Oh no! Oh man! Ugh. Oh, shit! No! Get on the lily pad! Oops. Okay. Oh cool, it brought me back here. Alright, sorry guys. Um... Are you guys excited about the- are you guys excited about the Thousand Year Door remake? I- I am legitimately curious. Will you settle for one of the coolest? I don't even know if I count as that, Pet, but I appreciate the, uh... <laughs> I- I appreciate the compliment for what it is, but I don't know if I qualify for that. Super Duper Nintendo, welcome in! Yeah, how are we feeling about the Thousand Year Door remake? Because I played that one on stream. That was the second game that I played on stream, and it was fantastic. It was so, so good. Um, I played it on GameCube, because that's what I had. But, um... I've heard some people who are really pumped, and their argument is it makes the game more accessible because it's hard to get your hands on an original copy, which I completely understand um, because it's so expensive these days, and they're really excited about it. And I've heard other people voice a different opinion, which is, you know, I really wish Nintendo were making new things. They could have put some energy into something else that was new content, um, and now they're going to mark it up to 60 bucks for people who think it's new, but it's not really new. So like, I understand both arguments. I was, I was hoping the next Paper Mario game that they worked on would be a Paper Luigi because it's hinted at a Paper Luigi in Thousand Year Door. I was really hoping that would be the next one that they would do. But no, I mean, a lot of people have told me Sticker Star is not something I should play. I kind of want to just to see what they're all talking about. But a lot of people have said Sticker Star, no bueno. But I, there's going to be so many people playing Thousand Year Door when it releases. So, I mean, it's going to be really great for the game. A lot of people are going to be playing it once it's more accessible. Feel like crying of happiness. Oh, cat. That's so sweet. Deku Scrubs, the only creatures that make bubbles fatal. Snot bubbles are fatal. So I think most of us could have told you to use the Song of Sorry to get back here, but I think we can join- Oh shit, I could have! Aw oh, man! I could have! Oh my god! <sighs> okay. I mean, I could, I could use it now. Then I wouldn't have to, like, jump from- Oh my god. <laughs> Magica! I appreciate you not saying anything. I appreciate you saying something now. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> As you endure, it was a great surprise, personally. I also got massively hyped for the Tomb Raider remasters. Oh, I must have missed that. Okay. Do you think there's gonna be fewer changes in Thousand Years? I don't know. I, I need to go back and look at the full... Because I watched the direct 
with someone else and I think I came in a few minutes late so I might have missed a couple things at the beginning so I think I need to go back and rewatch it that was when your door was like the big that was the big highlight for me I'm excited about Nintendo showing love to their IP you'll have to forgive me that just went straight over my head um but I'm really excited about this I I'm I'm kind of torn on the one hand, it's exciting to see it get so much love. And I know some people in my life that like will benefit from having it. But I do wish that I feel like they're going to market it as a new game almost. And it's not a new game. It's an old classic. It's an old classic that I just played not too long ago. <laughs> I don't know how else to put the sentence together, but getting up in the morning and not having any food at home genuinely ruins my day. I've skipped breakfast for three days now. Oh, I mean, Dinkle, it's not just you. I skip breakfast all the time and I completely understand your pain. We just need to get out and buy more breakfast food. That seems like a good solution. Just buy more breakfast food. You can eat garlic bread first thing in the morning. I won't judge. I'll do it with you. I need them to add a second pit of 100 trials. I, you know what? When I played Thousand Year Door the first time, I don't think I actually went back and, and did that. I don't think I went through the pit of 100 trials. I should have. If Thousand Year Door isn't changed like Mario RPG, I'm excited. Oh, like if they don't... Yeah, they better not change anything. I'm gonna be... <clears throat> I'm gonna be kind of pissed on everyone else's behalf if I find out that they've made changes to it. Because... Thousand Year Door is an excellent game. It doesn't need adjustment. It doesn't need anything. Don't change it. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. I'm... I would really like to play Super Mario RPG. Um, but I, I don't want... So if I play the Song of Soaring now, it could just... It could just get... You know what? It's just gonna get me over there. Let's just not, not be lazy. Come on, Fickle. We don't need to be lazy. It's like right there. Sorry. Sorry. I know you're just doing your job. Sorry. I have a copy of it um, on GameCube, so I think I'm a little bit spoiled. But yeah, you're right. I totally could have just played the song. It's right there. Okay. I got Thousand Year Door from a game preservation site and that's enough for me. Oh, it's it's so good. I loved it. It's not good enough for... Yeah. Yeah, it, it'll be interesting to see. I wonder what the um, what the sales will be like. I, I hope it goes well. I think they're going to push it pretty hard because it's a Mario game. Like, it's going to get a lot of publicity. So I'll be excited to see how many streamers choose to play it uh, after it comes out on Switch. Because I do think it's going to make it more accessible for people. It's going to be spendy, but it's going to make it more accessible. It's probably cheaper than going out to buy uh, the disc, because that's hard to come by these days. That's in your door for GameCube. It's over $100, so people need to stop complaining. <laughs> yeah. I think that's the thing. It's it's so expensive on GameCube. I would rather play on, on GameCube because it feels more original, but... You know, it feels more original hardware, original game. But I think it's going to make it much more accessible. So there's something, there's definitely something to be said for that. Okay, I'm going to skip so that, I'm going to skim through real quick so that I can catch everything. Which I have a copy of, nice. I'm of two minds. On one hand, it's fantastic that the game is more easily accessible. On the other hand, they could have just ported the GameCube version. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, I see what you're saying, Josh. I made it to the bottom, but I kept dying. The pit of 100 trials is brutal. I really kind of wish I'd done that, but now it's been so long. I feel like I, I kind of missed my opportunity because it's been so long since I played it. Oh, intellectual property. Thank you, Josh. I was struggling with that acronym. Thank you. Basically, Nintendo showing love to one of its franchise. Yeah. It's a good game. Wow. I'm, my my follow alerts are off today, but bipolar, welcome in. I'm sorry, I'm a little late on my, uh, <laughs> I'm a little behind on my chat, but thank you for the follow. I really appreciate it. Yeah, I, I think it's going to be a bunch of, a bunch of, uh, 
younger it's it's definitely going to be a bunch of younger players who are going to be discovering it for the first time it's not a new game but it's going to be discovered for the first time and it's going to feel like a new game and it, it does look like a nice look like they the um the graphics look really nice on it so i'll be intrigued to see what happens okay up left up left a right a i don't like this one Okay. Oh, Bipolar, you've never played Paper Mario before? Oh, I highly recommend it. There we go. That's what we needed. I highly recommend it, Bipolar. If you ever get the chance, please, please play Paper Mario. And, like, play the first one if you can. Paper Mario 64 was fantastic, but Thousand Year Door, in my opinion, was even better. I never say that. Sequels are never better than the original Nine times out of ten, they're not. But this was just so well done. It was so good. I went in fully expecting it to be not as good as the first one. And it was better. It was so good. It was so good. The dialogue was good. The companions, like the partners were good. Oh man, I barely made that. It was, it was just beautiful. What am I doing here? Is there something up here? Why is that there? Uh, oh, hello. I think he's trying to get in touch with me about my car's extended warranty. I don't like it. Okay. Um. Is there something down here that I missed? Come on, just a little bit. Is there a door? Oh my god, there's a door right there. It's just hard to see. Okay. It's a fairy! Alright, hang on. Oh man, I hate the bells. So, fairy lady said if I put this on, they'll come to me. Triforce, thank you for the hydrate. Yeah, bipolar, please. Please, I'm begging you. Treat yourself to a good thing. It's a really good thing. You'll like it. It's very cozy. It's, um, it's turn-based attack style. So, you know, depending on if you like it. But it's, it's a very, it's a good time. It's very bright. It's very colorful. The music is banging. It's so good. Ion, thank you for the hydrate. I appreciate it. Thanks for, thanks for looking out for me, guys. I'm gonna skim to catch up. Doesn't read any fast. I'm sorry, Mishka. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm skimming. I own Thousand Year Door, the original and Super Paper Mario on Wii. Never played through either yet. Part of the backlog. Oh, Josh. Now's such a good time. Now is such a good time. Please. Please. And if you stream, I want to watch it. I don't, I can't like, I can't remember who streams and who doesn't sometimes. But if you stream, I want to watch a first time playthrough. I love Paper Mario. It's so much fun. Currently being forced to play it. It's pretty good though. <laughs> yeah, I'm forcing you to play it. It's a really good time. I'm enjoying watching someone else enjoy it for the first time. Fickle, is your body ready for a temple? Oh, is that in reference to the to the hydrate? <laughs> I think I think my body is fairly ready for this temple. Let's do this shit. Thank you for the posture check. When I say thank you, I mean thanks. I guess. <laughs> Cat. Oh, you're taking care of my back problems. I appreciate you. Even if I hate posture check. Okay. Uh, also, my number one favorite Zelda game. Throwback to these graphics. Yeah, this is, this is played on N64. So, uh, these are... These are original graphics here. <laughs> We're doing it justice today. The mask also glows if there's a fairy in the room, you get a reward for finding them all. Oh, like if you find them all in the game, you get a reward? Okay. <sighs> there's something about this game that makes me want to 100% it just because... Come here. Come here, beautiful. Ah, uh, straight fairy. The 
this is my first one. Wait, 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 wait. If there's a reward for finding them all, can someone tell me if you know how many are there? I do want to know that because if there's a reward for it, oh, each dungeon has an award. Oh, okay. Never mind then. Uh, I thought it'll show on the map menu. Okay. Is there a, uh, the map menu that I, oh, 15. Okay. Sweet. All right. Um, I won't spoil, but getting all the fairies in dungeon gives you great rewards. Awesome. Thank you, guys. I really appreciate it. I'll probably try it out. Never played Pikmin either. I have not played Pikmin either. Bipolar is not just you. I've never touched Pikmin. I want to start with Pikmin 1, which I know is going to be hard to find, but I like to go to shopping at retro stores to find games for stream. So one of these days, we're going to find it. I'm looking. I am. You'll have more than enough time to finish the temples just to assuage your anxiety. Oh, okay. So I don't have to worry about running out of time. Do, does the timer still... I'm guessing it still counts down in here. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, yeah. It's still moving. Okay. I thought I thought it stopped moving for a minute. I was like, is time suspended? I was going to be really excited. How far is Mishka and Paper Mario? Uh, yeah, just finished chapter three. Don't say anything because Mishka's getting there. Mishka's getting into my favorite chapter which is chapter four. I know that's not most people's favorite, but it's mine. <laughs> it's on my list for first time playthrough. I plan on streaming it. Oh, please do. And and before you, before you start, can you tell me? <laughs> Cause I want to watch it. I love watching first time playthroughs of paper Mario. She says, thank you. In the same way she says, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Posh check is fine. Yeah. I do stream. Yes, I currently don't have the means to stream. That is, yeah, I just stream from... Oh, okay. Yeah, if you ever get the chance, I would love to see it. I mainly do retro anyway, so it fits. There you go. Okay. Okay, all in the temple. Got it. Got it. Sorry, guys, I'm skimming because I got to catch up because I am like five minutes behind on the chat. I say that as if it's a new thing. It's really not. I'm always behind on chat. This game's making it worse because there's a clock. The hair's glowing. There's a fairy in the room. So I sh what I'm hearing is I should just wear it all the time. I should look scary all the time. I don't like this mask. It's really kind of frightening. I want to play Pikmin so bad. They sell one and two on the Switch store. They do, but I like to play it on original if I can. It's it's more fun for me. It's It makes it harder because I have to find it in shop. But when I do find it, it's such a good feeling. When you find that game you've been looking for forever, it's such a good feeling. I have to get them on Switch. Hannah, welcome in! Don't let her lie. She's played Pokemon. Wait, what? She's played Pokemon? Well, yeah, I've played Pokemon before. What do you mean? Oh, that was a bad joke. I got it. Sorry. Took me a minute. Everyone keeps pipes in their pockets. <laughs> Everyone. It's true. Why did I say that for... Oh, okay. For a minute, I thought that said Legend of Dragoon. I was like, hang on. I didn't say that there. You should add a channel in Discord for people to post when they're streaming. I've thought about it. Um, I've, I've thought about it before. The concern that I have is I have also seen other streamers who... Um, I've seen other streamers who have a channel in their Discord where they, people can share that they're going live. And they, they use that to share that they're going live, which is fine because that's what the channel is for. But then the streamer discovered that, um, that they were saying some pretty some pretty awful things in their stream that did not support the streamer's ideals as far as, you know, not being racist or sexist or, you know, so I I think I would I would be okay with it. I would just need to add a rule in there somewhere. My my Discord needs a bit of an overhaul, I'm not going to lie. Um so I it is something that I'm going to add in the future, I think. It's just one of those things that I want to nail down all the rules on the Discord before I do it. So I need like a solid day or two to overhaul the discord because it needs it needs some homey touches to make it ready for things like that 
So I absolutely hear what you're saying. I want to do it. I just don't seem to have the time for this stuff. Because, like, when I'm not here, I've got a full-time job. And when I'm not doing that, I'm asleep. <laughs> maybe, maybe that's something I need to, like, set into my schedule, you know? Like, this is the day. This is all I do all day. And just sit down and get it done. But I'm too easily distracted. It's that ADHD. It kicks in hard. Oh, wait. And I can't, I can't wear this all the time. I can't wear this all the time because I've got to... Let's see. Let's, um, let's equip both. How's that? We'll stick both in our pocket. Um, I'll tell you for sure. Feel free to follow. I just started streaming this week. Oh, you just started. You're brand new. Oh, that's so exciting. Yeah, please, please just give me a heads up. Um, and I, I'd love to check it out. Yeah, I'd love to. I usually strongly against stuff like this because people come in exclusively just to spam their shit and leave. Yeah, that's another that's another reason I've been a little a little leery. It might I wonder if there's a way to like I wonder if there's a way to set it so that people can't start they can't start posting in that section for a certain length of time. I wonder if that's a thing we could do. Like um, you know, they have to spend 30 days in the Discord to get the feel for the community and, you know, know what to say and not say. Because I just don't want them endorsing themselves and then opening up that can of worms, you know? But you can also, you can also, like, um, mute or ignore a channel. I know that's a function that you can do. So if we do end up d choosing to do that and it bugs you, Dinkle, there is, there are methods that you could use to, to just block that out. Which is perfectly fine with me. What is this? Hang on, before I go anywhere, this is something. What is this? Am I supposed to be playing music here? Maybe not. This looks like something. Okay. But what is- this looks like something. What's going on here? I wonder if I'm supposed to be... Up left, up left, A, right, A. Let's see if this does anything first. I will say, though, you've inspired me to do Legend of Dragoon sometime. It's a great game. Okay, so that's not it. I'm just going to ignore it then. We'll, we'll figure it out when we figure it out. Uh, night of the first day. Okay, we're fine. It's only night of the first day. We got time. We're good. Oh, what is that sound? What is that sound? What is that down there? Something's moving down there. What is that? That's not creepy at all. Okay, I don't like the looks of that. Money? Hey, 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 straight fairy. All right, now we're moving. Now we're cooking. Okay. Now I get it. I bought a GameCube and a copy. Oh, that's exciting, bipolar. That's so exciting. Oh yeah, it's fine. If you if you mess up on typos, we can usually get it. Or I'll just say something weird and then we'll we'll quote it and it'll work. Like content is content. I'll take it. Um, that makes sense, but if you need help, let us know. Yeah, thank you, Kanata. I, um, I've been toying with, you know, we've been talking about, uh, adding a mod or two because, you know, Mishka is fantastic, but he can't always be here. And, um, I'm, I'm toying with how I want things to work once we start adding more moderators and, you know, cause I want it to be as streamlined as possible. I don't want to just be like, here's all your power, go. Like that seems unwise. <laughs> so I've been trying to think of a way to make it as streamlined as possible and we'll see what happens. But again, that's one of those things that I gotta, I gotta make some time to do. 
and time is hard. Can I open this? Okay, I can. Um, I'm just, I want to look around for fairies, but I don't want to take too long either. I don't want to miss any fairies. The stench. This place stinks just like that poison swamp. Okay. I don't want to miss any fairies, though. Whoa. What is that noise? Oh, that looks like a trap if I ever saw one. Is that a treasure chest? It looks like a trap. Who do you think that is? The ashes... Wait, the ashes in the center of it still look fresh. Those are ashes? Okay, interesting. Um, okay, hang on. Uh... Demon, welcome in! Sorry, guys. I've been slow today. She just needs to actually work on it instead of watching Twitch streams, but that's none of my business! Mishko, you're right. I get sidetracked a lot. I need to stop watching other people and just do stream things, but there are so many interesting people on Twitch. Or you could give people a role that allows them to post if you- Oh, that's a good idea. We could- we could do that. That's a good idea. I went to the store and I got a cereal I haven't had before. Opened the box and saw it expires on my birthday. Coincidence? I think not. <laughs> well, I hope you enjoy your cereal. You can make someone a certain rank for a trial period and after that trial period is passed, you can upgrade them. That's, that's a good idea, guys. That might work. One thing that I've seen works significantly better than a link spam is a role manager that can automatically assign you something and Discord sees that you've been streaming. Okay. Okay. Yeah, see, this is all stuff I need to learn. Like, I don't know a whole lot about Discord. People asked for it, so I gave them one, but it still needs a lot of, it needs a lot of fine tuning for sure. Where's the DeLorean when you need it? The music here is weird, but I kind of like it. It's just, it's a little, it's a little different. Speaking for myself, I don't mind talking about my streams and stuff with people if it comes up, but I personally don't really care about self promo stuff or use it mainly just because I feel like I'm link spamming or so. Yeah, see, the thing that the thing that kind of slows me down a little bit is I feel like when you make a channel like that, it's always the same three or four people who who use it every time, which is not a bad thing because that's what it's there for. But um, if it's just going to be a few people repeatedly over and over every day, I don't know if that's quite the the thing I'm looking for. So I I'm still I'm still toying with the idea. There's a couple things I know I absolutely do not want on Discord. There's a couple things that I'm like, okay, maybe under the right conditions. And this is one of those things where I'm like, under the right conditions, I could see it working. Thank you, Demon. Appreciate you. We love Mishka here. Mishka's great. Mishka works so hard for us. But Mishka is only one body. So there's that too. Like he works very hard, but he can't be everywhere all at once. If many people can say what they want, I don't care, but if you pedal art, it's an instant ban. Interesting. Tex, we had someone who found me on a YouTube short, sent me a message, and followed me, and subscribed, all in like 10 seconds. And I was like, oh, this is really weird. And then they popped into the Discord, and they spammed everyone uh, trying to, trying to uh, get commissioned work set up <laughs> basically so i had to um i had to kick them real fast and then send out a thing to everyone and be like hey she wants your money also i want your money <laughs> i was like if you're giving away free money i know a person eh? <laughs> really though i don't want your money like it's cool just just having you here is more than enough <laughs> okay Maybe set up a request system, have someone request to be able to post, but you have to pre -con Yeah, that could work too. Yeah. I hear what you're saying. It's a trap! <laughs> Alright, cool. We're catching up. We're good. I'm at the bottom of chat now, guys. As long as they're not rude about it. Yeah, this person was like... I had to explain, yeah, that's not a very professional way to, uh... To discuss being hired. Like, I didn't need any artwork, and also, they didn't ask. Like, they just kind of jumped right in there. Oh! What? Aw, oh, man! I didn't realize they were gonna be there, too! Well, now I'm like, where else are they? 
Really? They were just, oh, okay. Well, that's different. What is going on in this music? Well, now I have to get everything because what if there's a fairy hidden in this? <laughs> oh, they're everywhere. Okay. Um, well, now I'm really paranoid. I'm gonna miss one. I wanna get them all. I wanna catch them all. Okay. And this looks very questionable. These plants are going to eat me. What happens if I like... No? Okay. I'm gonna put parental controls on Twitch from 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. <laughs> Uh, I had to I had to turn down an invite to play a game uh, like a group game with someone in their discord yesterday because I was like man I'm so sorry I have to go to bed <laughs> like because I go to bed freakishly early oh shit is this thing gonna eat me it looks like it's gonna eat me that's kind of terrifying I can't this thing looks like it's gonna eat me Oh no! Oh, I'm not gonna make it! Mm. Okay. I wonder if it's like a like a thing where it doesn't trigger if I'm a Deku, but it does if I'm Link. I wonder if that's what it is. Yeah, it's it's a very active Discord. It moves quite a bit. Like there's a lot people have to say about retro games, and I love it. Like that's exactly what I want. In an ideal world, it will sustain itself without me having to be like, hey guys, what should we talk about? <laughs> like, that's perfect. That's what I want. Um, it just, it needs some fine tuning. That's all. Okay. I love this soundtrack. There we go. Hello. Okay. Number four. And there's 15. Okay. But there was a button somewhere. I saw it. Was it up there? Oh, I'm gonna get lost in here. I'm so gonna get lost in here. Whoa. I don't have arrows. Are we getting arrows? That would be nice. I do not like these flowers. They're gonna eat me at any moment. Toast is essential for breakfast. I love toast. Oh, pay attention. going on in here so I need to get over there can that can that make it maybe maybe I prefer my toast to French me too actually I'm gonna go with that that's a good answer I'm gonna go with that one make it make it make it make it yeah we're we gonna get a bow <gasps> okay not quite I'll take it though. All right. Um, if you come in, ask for my Discord and DM me some artwork and ask me if I'd like some, that's fine. You said hello and talked to me for a bit and formed a report. If you just come in and broadcast you're selling something, yes, that's exactly what happened, Kanata. It was someone who didn't even reach out and ask. They just did it and they spammed so many people in the Discord all with the same message. And, uh, I was sending them a, like, I sent them a private DM being like, who are you? Do I know you? Like, where are you from? And while I'm sending the messages, people in Discord were like, who the hell are you? Why are you sending me a friend request? You know, stuff like that. So I was like, okay, not cool. And we just got them out of there real quick. I think they're still subscribed to me though on YouTube. <laughs> but I was like, we can't have you doing that. This is not the place for that. It's not a professional way of behaving. 
and and they were cool with it they were like oh okay like that was it i'm very chatty i don't wait for people to find something to talk about that's fine i like it okay we got a key chatty people really help the discord just gonna say it's very helpful don't like these flowers. They look like they're gonna consume me at any moment. They're not good flowers. Uh, okay. Oh, I'm gonna get turned around in here. I came in that way, I think. I think. Maybe. Maybe. Hang on, there's a map. I should be paying attention to this. Ah. <sighs> If someone is nice enough about it, I may even buy some art. I may even tell my friends, damn, that's more than I would do. It has it has to be something that I really, really want for me to for me to buy art because there's so many different versions of a thing that I might want. And I'm going to keep looking for the the best, like the optimal version, because if I'm going to put my money into it, I, I have to be in love with it. I really just stream to record milestones and achievements of my progress. I don't use art or anything. It's just game, me, chat. I appreciate that, text. We're, uh, this game in particular, I changed up my style a little bit. Oh, okay. I changed up my style a little bit and we went highly minimal. Oh, shit. Okay. Sorry, guys. Uh, they're definitely saying Aflac. Can I do that? Ah! <laughs> yeah. Jerk. Okay. So, so that works. I just need to get to one of these. Ah! Oh, shit. Um. Down. <laughs> Okay, hang on just a minute, guys. Ugh, damn. Are you coming back? Ah! <sighs> Sounds like they're saying riffraff? Maybe they are! I am invading their home. That is a little rude. Next, they'll be calling me a street rat. Come on. There we go. There we go. Okay, all right. I just want to make sure there's nothing in here. No hidden fairies in the grass. This seems like one of those rooms where they'd stick a hidden fairy. Oh, reminder to subscribe. <laughs> that's not what I was going for, Kanata. <laughs> You're like, you guys are always welcome to, but that's not what I was going for. <laughs> um, all right, we need to, let's do this real quick. Cause I feel like this room might have something, maybe. Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. Worth a shot. All right. Oh, Kanata. Thank you for following them. That's really sweet. I, um, I'm one of those people. I'm a little picky about when I follow people. I will, I'm happy to follow people all the time, but I'm a little picky about when I do it because um, I don't want the list to get too cluttered, you know, because there, there's a lot of people that I want to follow. So I don't typically follow people until I get to see their content first, because I don't know what they stream. Okay. I got the key. Um, I need to, uh, I think I need to get up there. I don't know if I can. I'm comfortable in clutter, I thrive in it. Yeah, and I'm very, uh... 
I try to be minimalist when it comes to my stream stuff because there's just so much of it. It's hard for me to keep track of sometimes. So like when I'm raiding out to people, I want to I want to keep people on my list that I can I feel I can reliably raid out to without having to worry. Okay, no, that's not going to work. Oh shit. Shit, I didn't commit. Okay. Um Well, I think there was uh there was a room back this way that had a locked door, so maybe I need to backtrack a little bit. Maybe? I think there was a room with a locked door back here. Okay. I'm just making sure I caught up on everything. I always like that sound effect for some reason. Oh, the, like, the riffraff or the aflac or whatever it is. Poor turtles, I'm calling PETA! They had it coming, alright? That's all I can say, they had it coming. They knew what they were doing. How do I... Was there something around the other side? Yeah, there we go, I knew there was a door. Okay. Oh, hang on. What's up here? Oh, okay, this is where I came in. I believe. I believe this is where I came in. And this- this is something. It is. I think- What is that sound? Did you come back? What is that sound? Oh yeah, you came back. <laughs> this is like, enemy music is playing. Why is enemy music playing? Okay. That's something, but jumping down there seems, uh, questionable. Seems like a questionable option. It's okay, Pickle! I'll show you! <laughs> Kanata! That's so sweet. Morgan, hello! Happy Friday! How far a jump is this? Can I make this? What if, uh, what if I do this as Link? Can I make it now? Is this gonna kill me? Oh, okay, the flip was cool. What is this? What is this? Oh! Oh! Was there a torch in here? Oh! Wait a second. So I'm assuming I have to light this. Um... This looks like a bow and arrow situation, especially with the eye that we saw earlier. I don't think it's time for this yet. Okay, um... I don't think it's time for this yet. Just guessing here. This feels like something I'm gonna need something else for. So we'll move on. Ooh, hello. And what have we got? We've got bars over there and spiders over there. Okay, bow and arrow situation. Yeah, it feels like the kind of thing you gotta shoot. I follow a lot of people, but I only watch a few. Okay, I tend to watch streamers who don't yell a lot and are chill and chatty. I, you'll never catch me raging. I'm not a gamer rager, that's not me. Um, I usually laugh at stupid things that happen to me. Uh, and I very rarely have to like get up and walk away. I don't like talking to people with shitty opinions, to be honest. It's exhausting. I try to avoid people who are super negative. I I have a hard time around people who are super negative too. I I wanna give people space to feel what they're feeling, but if you're if you're coming in and you're negative all day, every day, all the time, it can be a little bit draining. Uh, I I tend to tell people, you know, if you're having a bad day, 
it's totally fine if you just want to lurk in stream. I'm okay with it. Because when I have a bad day and I choose to come to stream anyway, I regret it. <laughs> so if I'm having a really, really bad day, I might send something out to the Discord and be like, hey guys, I'm really sorry, but today's just not a good day. It happens. Every once in a while, it happens. And the last time... The last time it happened, I made the mistake of coming to stream anyway, and I regretted it, and I ended up leaving far earlier than I wanted to, but it was good that I left. This looks pretty light. Well, don't just stand there. Grab... Oh, we can just move it? Can I move it in Deku form? Oh, I can push it! Oh, okay. Uh, alright, that doesn't help me. Interesting, okay. Yeah, um, Kanata, to that point, I, I actually, I, I don't think she'll mind if I say, uh, I was, the last time I was having a really bad stream, um, I think Pumpkin was having a bad day too. Oh man, there was a stray fairy in that, so there might be a stray fairy in the other ones that I didn't kill earlier. Okay. Pumpkin was having a bad day too, and, uh, she, she made the very wise decision to, uh, like, to, to leave the stream. She was just like, I need to go take care of myself. I'm gonna lurk. And I was like, man, that's so smart. And the more I was thinking about it while I was streaming, will you come to me if you're stuck down there? No. Okay. I, I ended up sending her a message later and I was like, you know, I really, I really appreciate that you reminded me to take some time and feel better. Like, I need to follow that example more often because she was very good at, I just gotta step away and make myself feel better and then I'll, I'll come back another day. And I was like, that is such a good idea. And then I ended up ending stream early because of it. So I was like, damn, I should have been doing that. So I tell that to people all the time. I'm like, if you're having a bad day, it will not hurt my feelings if you need to take time for you because it's an important reminder to me too. Okay, so there are steps here, which makes me think I'm going to have to drain the swamp. <laughs> Not to get all political or anything, but it does look like that. Um, okay. And I do see a fairy down there. Can I? Probably not. Not until we... Yeah. Let's see. I tried backseating once. Problem was the streamer told me to get out of his house. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we uh, we have a firm no backseating, no uh, spoiler policy here because I know it's hard. I know it's hard because this game is... Some people just absolutely obsessively love this game and I totally get it. But it's really hard to hold back when it's your favorite game. I've been there. We were just talking about Paper Mario recently, and like, I love watching first time playthroughs of Paper Mario, but it's so hard for me to keep my mouth shut. <laughs> we don't tell, we bodily throw. Yeah, we, uh, we don't, we don't take any chances with that stuff. <laughs> Alright, um. Oh, yeah, I definitely need a bow for this. Well, ah! Uh Here's the thing, there's fire, there's fire in this room somewhere, I can hear it. I just don't remember where it was, so let's, oh, his flips are so cool in this game. Why couldn't we do this in, oh, it looks so cool. Link looks like a badass, Link never looks like a badass. <laughs> he looks so cool doing that. There it is. Like he's figured out the secret to parkour. <laughs> Okay. Damn, that's smooth. I could never do that. I'm not that coordinated. Are we gonna be able to get it over there though? My, my stick is gonna disappear before we do that. Where does this need to go? Up there? Shit. Okay. I don't know if I can make that, but we'll see. We, we shall see. Looks like a torch inside of a lily pad. Weird, but <laughs> yeah, I mean, it was weird. Um, Yoda joins the channel. You will be, you will be. 
Well, hi Yuki. I'm sorry, I'm a little behind. I mod for a few streamers and play a character in stream. My character plays a heel and antagonizes the streamer chat, loves it and creates interaction. There we go. Always good to check your fairy shimmer. Yeah, there's some fairies all over the place in here. I, why are there always butterflies around the torches? Or are they moths? Maybe that's it. Pumpkin is such a smart and sweet. She is. Yeah, pumpkin's great. She she showed um, she showed great self control, and I want to emulate that. Um, someone was being a jerk the other day, and I responded with, "You kiss your mother with that mouth," and they laughed and were super chill after that. I mean, yeah, sometimes it's just a reminder. Maybe maybe don't maybe don't do that. Sometimes you just gotta remember. Mothers don't appreciate it, and neither do we. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna push this. Um, I don't think it's gonna make it. I could try. Maybe the torches last longer in this game than in Ocarina of Time. But I seem to recall them not lasting very long at all. No, no, no. You kiss my mother. <laughs> no. Okay. <gasps> okay. Ugh. Did I just burn myself on the torch? You can do that in this game? I'm not gonna make it. Oh, oh, there was one right there. Oh, okay. I, I didn't even see that one. All right, we can do that. That's why I was so confused. I was like, there's no way we're gonna make it all the way up to the other one. That's doable. I didn't realize you could hurt yourself on the torches in this game. Go, 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 Fickle, go. Go, Link, go. Atta boy. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, there was another one up above. Uh, oh, shit. Okay. There was another one up here, I want to say. I think. I'm pretty sure. Welcome in, Chili. Okay. <laughs> Gotta catch up. Um, Flashbacks to stand on the red. What? Hides Majora's mask tattoo. <laughs> Obsessive, I think not. You have a Majora's mask tattoo. So, um, <laughs> so does Mishka. That's perfect. You two have found each other. Okay, um, Link has that frizz. I said that exact same thing. Sword beam, why couldn't I? Ah, uh, okay. Link played Mario 64 since his first adventure. But I was like, damn, I gotta start doing flips. Yeah, he, he's, he's learned from the best. Three hours later, I'm a little behind on chat. I know. I know. I'm, uh, I'm definitely not gonna get through this temple today either. I can tell it's... It's gonna take me more than the next 20 minutes or so. I mean, I don't kiss my mother. My dad does. That's not my job. Fair point, Ion. Fair point. We don't want to steal anyone's job. <laughs> my friend made the mistake of having video clips play on his stream and gave me full access to it. It's a small stream with like 5 to 10. <laughs> so I get away with it. Yeah, it's dungeon time. It's just... Okay, so I think there was another one up here. I'm just gonna make sure I know where it is. I'm pretty sure there was one up here too. Yeah, cause we gotta get the spider web out of the way. Here's the thing, I'm gonna have to, um, I'm gonna use the, uh, the owl save point before we go today. So we can come straight back here and continue it. Because we will definitely be able to finish it on Monday. Because Monday we can go as long as we want. Maybe... Okay. There we go. Okay, so... Can I jump across there with a... I don't know if I can. That's probably something I'm gonna... Um, maybe I can. Ouch! You can actually get hurt standing too close to that. Good to know. Spam the crap out of it and tell a story with the video clips. Ever think about how there was a day when your parent put you down and never picked you up again? <gasps> Mishka! Mishka! That's so sad! <laughs> That's so sad! 
Oh, it's the mods that hurt me. Why do they hurt me? They're just mods. Am I allergic to mods or something? Okay, um, can I make this? <gasps> oh my god, I can. No, shit. Oh, that's so cool. Why are the mods hurting me? Go away. Okay. Interesting. Why are the mods able to hurt me? Hero of time, but he can't handle bugs? There's so many doors in this place. I'm going to get lost. But that's true of every place we go. Okay. What is this? Oh, oh. Be careful, I sense a lot of evil here. <laughs> Thank God you're here. <laughs> okay, starting to think Dragoon was a 20 hour game. And <laughs> chat just made it last forever. Dragoon is a really long game, but uh, oh, what the hell? Ah! Oh, what is it? I can't see it. What the hell is this? <gasps> oh, whatever it is, they jump. Oh, I don't like this. I can't see shit. I don't know what's happening. Where are they? Are they gone? Are they gone? Should I be using a torch for this? Probably. I can't see. Oh shit! Go and jam! I don't like those! What the hell is that? <gasps> oh no! Oh god! <laughs> no! <laughs> what was that? <gasps> okay. Breathe, Fickle, breathe. <sighs> what the hell was that? <laughs> okay. I call them dust bunnies when I was a kid. I have never seen bunnies look like that. What was that? Okay. Whew. Not a spoiler, but the torches with the black metal on them will stay lit forever. The wooden ones will burn out. Oh! Thank you, Kanai. I did not know that. The torches with the metal will stay lit forever. The wooden ones will burn out after a few... Oh, well, that's not super great. They're eating your clothes. Oh. Well, that's fine. We can do this naked. I've seen other people do much worse things with their characters naked. Like... Link's fine, I'm sure. Well, but Link's a child. Maybe we don't want to do that. That's not good. Twitch definitely would not approve. I sense a lot of evil here. You don't say. <laughs> Morgan, I need someone to follow me around and just be like, I sense some evil. <laughs> just, you know, with random... I'm going to start thinking that when I talk to people. I'm going to be like, I sense evil in you. I'll feel like a Jedi. Those are actually called black bows. Oh. Okay. Bows? Is that right? So it's not, not a Poe. Like, that's not a typo. My internet's having issues. I may have to head off for a bit. If I don't return, everyone have a good day. Pet, that's totally fine. I hate internet issues, but I totally get it. And um, I've, I've got roughly 20 minutes to half an hour left anyway, so you won't miss a ton. But that was terrifying. That was scary. I didn't like that. Clothes are for rich people. <laughs> Link's used to slumming it. He's fine. <laughs> but she's just she's a devil and poisonous swap. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, well, what do I do? I'm scared to unpause. <laughs> They're gonna eat me. That's fine. We can do this naked. <laughs> it's fine <laughs> Ishka thank you for the quote that one will come in handy 
eight thirty one. That's three hours behind me. Yeah, I um I usually leave for work around nine ish my time because I work a little a little later. So, um, yeah, yeah. I have to I have to leave work at the same time most days so that I can go do things at the job. You know, earn money, all that good stuff. You're gonna have to go Danny DeVito mode. <laughs> Anyways, I started swinging. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh god, I'm scared. Okay. Um. Are they still here? Can I like? Does this? Oh, I can't see. I don't know where I'm going or what I'm doing. Did I come into the wrong? <laughs> Oh god! Oh, there's a torch there! Oh, there's a torch there! Oh, that was terrifying. I don't like those! The eyes! The eyes! I don't like those at all! Okay. Where's the torch? Where'd the fire go? Yeah, let's get the fire. And we'll put the fire over near the door. Oh, shit, where'd the door go? Yeah, you. Light! There we go. Is there another one? I'm so scared they're gonna jump out at me. I'm so scared. Is there another one around here somewhere? Oh, I'm so scared. There's gotta be more in here. Guys, I don't like this. I don't like this. Why did we do something spooky? <laughs> okay. There's a torch here. Where'd the fire go? Okay. There's a torch over here somewhere. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? There we go. I do not like this place. This is like the perfect use for magic. It's the eyes! The eyes creep me out! Ah! What are they? It was such a happy little time for a very unhappy place. Okay. I can't even see. I can't see enough to get the box. Okay. There it is. <sighs> oh, son of a bitch. Okay. Kill the black bow. <laughs> That was so scary! Wait, but what about this door? <sighs> oh, did I kill them all then? Because the box opened up, so I assume I got them all in this room. But how do I get out of here? I can't see! <laughs> okay. What do I do? Um... Well, shit. Where am I? Hold up, go back. That was terrifying! Okay. Anyways, I started blasting! <laughs> when I'm scared, I also grab a sword and start swinging uncontrollably in the dark! That's basically what we're doing now, guys. That's how elaborate this is gonna get. Oh my god, that was terrifying! I'm never gonna be be safe in the dark again. I, going to bed at night is gonna freak me out. I'm gonna imagine just the eyes lighting up before they just... Uh, huh. You eradicated the dust bunny population in this room. Now they'll never see their families ever again. Are you proud of yourself? <laughs> yes. Yes, I am. <laughs> These are the torches that time out. Oh, shit. Okay, so what you're telling me is I need to find... I need to find the other ones and get them lit, like, now. Oh! Oh! Because they time out! Well, where are the other ones? I can't see. I can't see. I can't see. There's one. There's one. Ah! <laughs> okay. Okay. 
This door? Wait, was it this door or the other one? Oh, shit. Wait, no, I came in through a tunnel, so it should be the door. <sighs> that was the worst room ever. That was the worst. See, just got a nudge, just a tiny bit. Yeah, just a baby nudge. That was so scary. Um, okay, this one. Um, I need this platform, I'm guessing. Oh no, come back! Oh man. Oh shit, okay. <gasps> oh! Oh! Oh no! 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 <sighs> I didn't realize there was an edge there. I can't see anything in this place. Oh! <laughs> Killer dragonflies! Whoops. Hello, is that family friendly no swearing Christian screen? No. Scuff, no. <laughs> no, we allow swearing in here. We also don't advertise as family friendly. We advertise as 18 plus for a reason. <laughs> we we try to like keep it to PG-13 vibes, but I don't want any kids in here. <laughs> I I don't want that. Especially not with some of the things that we talk about occasionally. Oh, come on. Thank you. Wow. That was rough. Now I gotta go all the way back. Okay. That's cool, too. That's cool. <clears throat> Pterodactyl boyfriend. Yeah. We don't, we don't need the kids exposed to that. Kids these days don't need to be exposed to hot pterodactyl boyfriend. I embarrassed myself in a PG stream yesterday because I didn't realize. Oh no, Hannah, what'd you say? <laughs> what did you say? I don't mind swearing because I swear. So like, it seems kind of hypocritical for me to be like, now hang on, Hannah. <laughs> I'm going to do it. So, yeah, what did you say? I have to know now. Like, what was it that made the pearl clutchers clutch? <laughs> we don't want another library situation. No. No, we don't. I still can't believe that happened. Okay, so for the people who know what happened, I'm just gonna tell you. Yesterday, his mother came in with the letter that we sent home describing the, the teenager's behavior. I'm gonna be kind of vague here. It was not appropriate behavior for the library. It involved some body parts that should not be... Uh-uh. <laughs> um, he got a letter home. His mommy came in to talk about it. And uh, she wants to talk to the manager because she believes that punishment is like... Punishment is appropriate, however, like, she's definitely going to, uh, push for leniency. And, um, in- in a case like this, I am not at all inclined for him to get any leniency. But it's not up to me, it's up to my manager. Oh, shit. So, uh, so that's a thing that's happening. It's a very, very weird situation. And, um... I'm really glad I'm not the manager. Because, ew. Can I shoot them in the face? No dare work call in the middle of this! I mean, it happens. You do what you gotta do. I totally get it. Work never has good timing, do they? Um... Shit, I'm lost. I'm so lost. Hang on. Okay. My son watches me. I can't cuss. I'm always, that was a silly mistake or, oh dear. Goodness gracious golly gee willikers. 
<laughs> Can you imagine if we were fighting the the bows or whatever they are and I started screaming, G Walkers! <laughs> I cuss, but I have my lines on what I will and won't say. That's fair. Yeah, that's fair. I swear, but like there are certain things I won't say. Certain words are still off limits. That makes sense. I just said I fight all these hoes when he was talking about skipping some enemies. <laughs> oh, Hannah. You're right. That's not PG, but I love it all the same. <laughs> okay, I won't leave my kids in here when I get them in a few years. Noted. Yeah. Just, you know, don't leave them in here unattended because it's an 18 plus stream. And as soon as I suspect that someone is a child, out they go. <laughs> it's nothing personal. It's nothing against them. It's just I have seen streams full of children and I never want to go back. <laughs> I haven't been there since then because I'm like, oh, we got a lot of 14, 15 year olds in here. OK, so there's no impulse control whatsoever. That's what I'm hearing, because that's that's the case. There's just it's not their fault. Developmentally, their brain has not has not finished cooking and they haven't finished completing that impulse control. It's just not there yet. It's something that they will get. They just don't have it yet. <clears throat> I want to talk to the manager. The the word, yeah. Get your cameras ready, folks. Oh my god. I I wish I could be there for that conversation because I want to know how she's going to excuse this behavior that her son has taken part in. Um, just for anyone who's new here, I'm going to be very vague about it because I know Twitch is, uh, maybe sensitive about behaviors of minors that are inappropriate. So like, I'm trying to be sensitive of that. It was solo activity on a computer. That's all I'm going to say. Use your imagination. Get as dirty as you want to, because that's what happened. But like, we're going to be vague. Um, essentially he broke the rules and he got kicked out of the library because ew. And um, and now his his mother wants to appeal. <laughs> I'm like, how in the world are you going to explain this? <gasps> oh no, there's more of them down here. Oh, oh! oh my God. I just jumped into a room of them. Oh, that was not the intention. Oh, what are they? They don't even have a shape. They're just, they are dust bunnies. Oh my God. They are dust bunnies. Die. Die. What are they? Ugh. Okay. That's a thing. That's a thing to happen. Whew. Huh, Scuff, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Oh shit, I don't like these. Do I have to kill them all? Is there something else in here that I'm gonna get if I kill all the evil dust bunnies? Are we just cleaning up their room? Is that what happened? Like, I was told I was on a rescue mission, but I'm actually just cleaning their house. Oh shit. The princess is gonna show up and be like, thanks, I hate chores. <laughs> Okay. Die. 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 Oh shit, they're everywhere. I can't even see. Okay, did I get them all? I don't think that was all of them. I just don't know. Like go to all the little corners all the little dark corners of this room make sure they're all gone it's really dark in here I can't see shit not to mention it really doesn't help that like my eyes are terrible I saw a ladder where'd the ladder go I did see a ladder earlier Where'd it go? 
Okay. Um. Hmm. The hell? There was a ladder. I saw one. Where'd it go? Okay. I'm officially confused. There was one. You know, when you get used to this, the music's really cool. Alright. Tell you what, let's do this. Let's do this. Uh, oh, wrong button. Okay. Oh, my eyes. It actually hurts trying to figure out where I'm going. Oh, cool. I can just soar back to the entrance. That's perfect. Crap, I just read what I wrote up there. Oh, that's okay, Tex. I, I got it. I understood. Um... Okay, I want to leave this real quick. Yeah. Oh no, can I not make it? Come on, come on, come on! Yeah! Alright. Much better. That's a fairy. I want that. Oh, whoops. Oh no, where'd you go? Oh, come on. Yeah. Okay. Let's just set something else there, because I don't want to accidentally use it when I don't want it. We're gonna go back to this. Alright. This is where I'm gonna save for the day, guys, because I do have to go to work soon. Um, but I just want to make sure, I want to make sure I save before I forget. Um, I'm, I'm catching up, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> Sounds like a legal case. Yeah, it was, uh, yeah, yeah. What he did was very illegal. Frankly, they're very lucky that we didn't report it to the police because it was a crime. So, uh... He's lucky that he's just getting trespassed from the building for a while. It's a long while, but he's actually very fortunate. And I think if mom gets told that, then she'll kind of reassess. Because frankly, she should be more concerned about her son's behavior and less concerned about the punishment that he incurred during said behavior. He should be more concerned about why he thinks this is okay. Um... You know, just basic things that you... I, I guess this is a thing he's gonna have to learn. It's a good learning opportunity, we'll just say. Only real gentlemen get horny around books. He shouldn't be punished. Uh, it wasn't the books. It was YouTube, of all things. YouTube. Was very exciting. I don't even know what he was watching, but it was very exciting, apparently. I do say goodness gracious a lot. Good! Good, it's a, it's a good term. You should use it. Yeah, my seven-year-old daughter tells me no naughty words when I cuss while I'm working. Oh, Chili, that's sweet. No, that's good. That's a really good thing. You've got, uh, you've got a sensor built in right there to let you know when you, when you fuckered up. <laughs> I never swear unless someone else does it and it goes down well. Yeah, I don't mind swearing. Um, you know, just... There are certain words that, you know, shouldn't be said in polite conversation, so just keep that in mind. But, um, he's a mother poo-poo head. There you go. Poo-poo head. Cussing is whatever. I don't care if people do it, I swear a ton, but being blatantly sexist or racist- Oh yeah, that's a huge no-no. Like, there's a big difference between swearing and being sexist or racist or homophobic or whatever it is. Like, there's a huge difference between the two things. If you're gonna use it, use it responsibly, but there's a big difference. Yeah, it's it's never okay. Sculpting? Yeah, sculpting. That's exactly what was happening. If you're 18 plus and you need to 
be explained. You need. <laughs> uh huh. Oh, computer, not books, not a gen. No, not a gentleman, not a gentleman. But you know, learning opportunity. <laughs> he went on. <laughs> Kyle. Certain things uh, happened, and that's all I will say. Yeah. I went away for 45 minutes to eat and stuff, and now we're talking about dirty kids in libraries. What happened? Uh, it's just a thing at work, Josh. Uh, yeah. Teenage boy got really inappropriate on a computer. That's all I'm going to say. Like, just inappropriate. Uh, use your imagination. And uh, he got caught, and he got kicked out. And he's going to stay kicked out for a while. Well, his mother showed up yesterday with the uh, letter that we sent home detailing his behavior, uh, wanting to appeal. And I'm like, hold up. How are you going to argue this? I wish I, I wish I could uh, be a fly on the wall during that discussion, but I can't. It's going to go higher up than me. So someone else is going to have to deal with it. I don't get paid that kind of money, but I am very intrigued to know what happens. Being critical and being negative are not the same thing either. No, they're not. No, I agree with you there. Um, being critical, you can be critical and still be uh, respectful and, you know, understanding of other people's stances. There's a big difference. The weird thing about that PG stream is the mod was like, don't let it happen again and use an emo of a- Oh. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait. You apologize and use a, a gun emote back, but that violated their guidelines. You can't have, you can't, um. That seems very hypocritical to me. If they have, if they have a mod who has a wolf pointing a gun and you apologize and use a gun emote back, you're reciprocating their behavior. If that behavior violates their guidelines, then they need to take a look at their own policy interesting the music's got yeah it's got a very cool feel to it it's very interesting it's a good sound it took some adjusting but i like it okay i'm gonna save here real quick yeah so we're gonna save i i don't want to go back to day one because i think i can get it in this time i just need to um i need to come back another day and finish that out. Okay, cool. How old was this minor? He was 14. Which feels pretty young. But what do I know about 14-year-old boys? I was never a 14-year-old boy. And when I was 14, I didn't care about boys anyway, so like I don't know anything about that. It's just it's it's old enough to know better. Yeah, for sure. If you're old enough to um carry out that behavior you're old enough to know better in my mind he's certainly old enough and he wasn't even like he wasn't even in a room like he wasn't in a closed room or in a dark corner he was right in the middle of everything everything there were people sitting around him like that that shows a lack of just every kind of knowledge that is necessary so he will learn he will learn this way like there's there's something else going on. I don't know if it's a if it's socialization or um, or lack thereof, or if you know there's something going on at home, or if there's maybe a some kind of disconnect that I don't see. Um, but but there's there's something wrong with the situation, and everyone in the family is going to know about this. <laughs> so. It, it could be, yeah, it could be a mental health concern. Um, at first, I was concerned about um, about maybe trauma in the household. Like, that can happen sometimes. Um, so I was concerned about that. But I'm, I'm more concerned about the fact that mom is defending the behavior. That concerns me more. Because um, that's not... That's not behavior that I would defend. <laughs> and I don't feel like the average parent would defend that behavior. So, um, you know, again, that's above my pay grade. It's not something that I'm going to be dealing with the ramifications of. That's something that's going to go higher up than me. But I will be intrigued to see what happens. 
Yeah, it's not it's not behavior the law defends either. It's it's very illegal. Um Yeah, so we'll see what happens. In the meantime, I know this is a really weird place for me to stop, but I do have to skedaddle and go to work. <laughs> I know this is a really weird conversation. Um I'm gonna go ahead and head out for the day because it is time. Oh, interesting. My audio stopped on this end. OBS is being weird today. Oh no, no, it didn't. Never mind. It was just music stopped. Okay. Um, let's just see really quickly if there's anyone around. I've rated a few people recently that um, you know, I've rated them repeatedly, and I don't like to rate out to one person too often. So actually. It looks like a quiet day. I may just end here for the day. I may wrap up. Um, I so appreciate you guys being here. All those people who um, who hung out with us today, I so appreciate it. And I appreciate the new follows as well. Oh no, Gradask, I'm so sorry. But welcome. Welcome to the, to the stream. I'm sorry, I'm just about to leave. I have to go to work. <laughs> oh, thank you for the follow. Is it Nebular? Is that how I say it? Is that what you were going for? Because I love how creative you were to get there. Nebular, thank you for the follow. And also, I just want to thank everyone else who followed today because we had we had quite a few people come through. Scuff, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it quite a bit. Bipolar, welcome in. And Northwind. And we had a bunch of people who resubbed too. That's so sweet of you guys. Thank you so much. Oh. Nebula and oh. That's a really cool combination. So... So it's Neb. Is it? Please correct me if I say this wrong. Is it Nebulira? Lyra? Nebulira? Please correct me. I'm. I will fix myself to say the right thing. Is it Lyra? Like a like a hard. Yeah. Okay. I feel better about that. Thank you. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna call it for the day. Um, I don't actually see anyone that I know that's rating. So or uh, streaming, excuse me. So I'm just gonna end it here today. I had a lot of fun. I'm gonna be back on Monday for sure. So uh, Monday morning, we'll come back and we'll just keep playing and we'll we'll keep going through this uh, dungeon with the terrifying creatures. I hope you guys all have an awesome Friday and I hope it is your Friday. And if it's not your Friday, I empathize, but don't worry, we'll get there. Have a good day, everyone, and uh, happy gaming. <laughs>